Hey BC, it's Jeff here. Thanks for joining me today. Appreciate everybody stopping by, uh, checking out the video, the new KISS release uh, that happened on June 10th, Friday. Uh, worked all weekend, so just getting back from the record store, uh, picking up my order that was held for me. I uh, didn't want to miss out on this one. It is the third in their series of the authorized bootleg series. Uh, from KISS, uh, Off the Soundboard, uh, this one coming back from 1996. Uh, but let's talk a little bit first about uh, lineups from the first two. Uh, we had uh, Tokyo 2001 uh, with three of the four original band members, uh, Paul, Gene, Ace, and Eric. Uh, <clears throat> the second one that was released was Virginia Beach 2004. Uh, we have the current lineup on this one. And uh, obviously now we have the original four, uh, which made it, you know, pretty much something different, I guess, to keep the fans coming back. Also, a few uh, keynotes about this one. Uh, it is uh, off the soundboard live at Donington. Uh, Monsters of Rock, August 17th, 1996. Obviously, you know, the time of their uh, reunion tour, Donington uh, Park, uh, the Monsters of Rock Festival, the annual. And I believe from what I remember or read was that uh, they closed up at that time uh, with this recording. And I mean, after all, who's going to follow Kiss on a live show who would be crazy enough to try and follow kiss with that so Current lineup with this one was paul gene ace and peter but um we are going to take just take a look at the inside really quick uh nothing special about the packaging on these they are holding true to uh the unofficial bootleg uh albums usually by fan made and uh that's what's kind of nice about this one. It is a no frill album, which is kind of nice, but uh, we did notice a little bit of a change on the white inner sleeves on the last release that they did polyline them. Not sure if they continued on this, but let's just take one album out uh, and see what we this one is LP1 and from LP1 we have side one is Deuce King of the Nighttime World Do You Love Me Calling Dr. Love side two is Cold Gin Let Me Go Rock and Roll Shout It Out Loud and no we do not have a polyline inner white sleeve on this one uh, it is just the paper sleeves. Uh, a little disappointing on that, for sure. So, yeah, but the uh, same white label. Uh, LP2 is side three, Watching You, Firehouse, Shock Me. Side four is Strutter and God of Thunder. And we don't have to... Take the vinyl out. And LP3, side five, Love Gun, 100,000 Years, Black Diamond, side six, Detroit Rock City, and Rock and Roll All Night. So that is the third in the series with the original lineup from Donington. Uh, jolly Old England at the park uh, during the Monsters of Rock Festival, uh, I believe, and their final uh, annual festival at that, which makes this kind of a special and unique uh, pressing to get just from that standpoint alone. So anybody who's going to get it, go enjoy it, give it a spin, whether it be CD or vinyl. Uh, I doing both as always. So that's it guys. That was the pickup. Uh, take care everybody.
I'll talk to you guys soon.